Hi, I'm Joshua. And I'm Shaquan. And this is Winston Great Saga. Welcome to another beautiful people video. Uh, Welcome to another beautiful that's more it is. It is. Welcome to another beautiful Thursday, beautiful people. How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? I gotta write the third time. Third time counts. The third time. Hmm. It's been a great week for us. Real good week. We are now preparing to leave for New York. Hey. We're going to New York Saturday through basically Thursday something I don't know so make sure that you're following us on Instagram hey. Ting. and we will be doing a quick vlog while we're there we'll, be and vlog, there. we'll vlog and that video will post sometime mm -hmm. this month make sure you watch that as well and also all you new beautiful people hey. welcome to the Winston Gray Saga family how you doing what's the tea how's it going welcome Josh, what are we doing today? I don't know. I said, let's do a, a, a video. And then you said, okay. You said, what? I said, I don't know. And so Shaquan said, I don't know either. Because when you get two Libras in a room, then I don't know becomes the answer because you're both indecisive and the scales are never balanced. I am surprised that we are able to eat ever because we can never make a, a simultaneous <laughs> decision on what to do for dinner let alone bigger decisions. <laughs> Where to go for vacation? That took four years. Really? Yes. Whatever. Anyway, so Shaquan went to YouTube Trends and said, you know what, let's do the Would You Rather Challenge. Tag. Video. Words. So, let's get started. These questions are kind of raun raunchy. Oh God, <laughs> girl! No, I cannot do this. I'm pure of mind, body, spirit. You're pure of soul. Mess. That's the only thing you're pure of. So, <laughs> would you rather smell like poop and not know it, or constantly be smelling poop that nobody else can smell? Ooh. Next. There's no next. E. None of the above. There's Ew. only A and B. Girl, no. Mm. Mm -mm. No, that, that, those are both. Those are both next. Would you rather smell like poop and not know it, or constantly be smelling poop that nobody else can smell? I would rather smell like it, never smell it. I'm taking the selfish approach. Yeah, that's very selfish of you because everyone else has to smell your shit. My pussy smells like roses, bitch. Apparently not, because you smell like shit. F*** you. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry that you recognize roses as roses and shit as shit. I recognize shit as roses and roses as shit. You think about that and you get back to me. <laughs> I, I don't know what that means. I think that... I would um, like to, I would prefer to smell shit because I, um, I would prefer to smell shit because I would get used to the smell eventually <laughs> and I don't have to worry about people perceiving me as um, an unclean person. Question number two. Would you rather <laughs> eat only roadkill for the rest of your life or have everyone else in the world sound like Gilbert Gottfried. Gilbert Gottfried for 100, please, Alex. You know who Gilbert Gottfried is, right? Yes, yes, I do. Hi, everybody! That. That. But. Ew, roadkill. Gross. It's like eating McDonald's every day. People do it. Not I. For legal reasons. 
I, I, I guess I would say the same thing, but that voice, I, I guess you would... You would get I, used I, to it. You get used to the voice. You would get used to eating roadkill every day, too. No, no, you wouldn't. You would be dead. You still have to listen to Gilbert Gottfried's voice. For at least 50 more My years. My voice smells like, sounds like that, too. So does mine. <laughs> Number three. Would you rather always have to say everything that's on your mind or never be able to speak again? Always say everything that is on your mind or never be able to speak again. Say everything on my mind. Half the time I do it anyway. My mom always told me, if you have nothing nice to say, wait till someone asks you and then give it. So that is hard for me to always speak my mind unless someone asks for my opinion. But see, I was taught the golden rule. What's the golden rule? <laughs> treat every, treat and treat your friend how you want to be treated. And so I would rather be told if I look a hot mess, watch it. Don't, <laughs> don't play me. Do not play me. I know. Honesty is the best policy. This is real. This is authenticity. Okay. I know what it looks like. Anyway, I know I would like to be treated as if, bitch, you rude as hell. Because things can be forgiven and things can be changed in your brain. I would rather progress my thoughts rather than keep them in for the rest of my life. No, that's not what it says. It says, always say everything that is on your mind. Yes. So you don't have time to think about your thoughts and retract statements in your head before you speak them. What comes to your mind immediately is immediately what spews from your mouth. But after so long, after getting into so many arguments and, and educated debates, mm. and you know, hearing others be like, what the hell is wrong with you? Why the hell would you say stupid shit like that? Da 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 da. Mm -hmm. We have a quick conversation. Uh, oh, okay, I'm sorry. I, I realize I'm wrong. And then after a while. That's what would immediately come to your mind is to apologize? Yeah. That's how my brain works. Because I'm sensitive to others and. I'm sensitive to others and their emotions. That's just how I work. I'd rather keep my mouth shut for 200 Alex. Good. Because inside there, I know it's pure evil. I'm not sensitive to people's emotions and you really don't want to hear everything that goes through my head. That's why I keep my mouth shut until you ask for my opinion. Mm -hmm. Now, because you've asked for my opinion, you are subjected to listen. No matter what I have to say, you ask for it, now you gotta get it. So, it's best for you yeah, I just keep my mouth shut, Alex. I'll just, I'll just, I'll just sit here in silence for the rest of my life. Mm. Why doesn't that work inside our house? Because you, you just tell me everything. Like, yeah, because it's not a would you rather, and because you are who you are, you are subjected to my opinion no matter what, you and gonna, vice versa. You gonna make me a wholesome Christian woman by the time I'm seventy, amen. Mm -mm. Cause. Forgiveness. Seventy must never come. Silence. <laughs> Would you rather go through life with a perpetual cold sore on your mouth mm. or go through life with a booger hanging from your nose? Mm. Cold sore. Because it's just a cold sore. I mean, it ain't nothing. It is something. It is uh, I'm sorry. There are many strands of herpes and there is the sexual disease, but there are others out there. But nobody can tell the difference. What do you think their mind is going to automatically go to? And if it automatically goes to that and you judge me right off the bat, bye, bitch. I don't need you. I judge you. Bye, bitch. Bye. <laughs> well, I know people who actually would rather walk around with a booger hanging from their nose because they do it every damn day. It's oh. disgusting. It's like, do you? I... Mm. I know somebody like that. It's not culturally appropriate to tell you you need to do something about that. She just... Carmen just barked. Mm -hmm. She doesn't do that. Mm -hmm. We'll be right back. And we're back. Hi! <laughs> <laughs> Children. Number five. Would you rather have vaginas for ears 
or have penises for fingers? Penises for fingers, please. Yes. What? Why? Because I like the look of penises. They're cute. Okay. Plus, it would make us. That's other. 10 penises. <laughs> well, it depends on how you look at it. It could be 8 or 10 penises. The question wasn't specific. Oh my god. <laughs> Either way, I mean, it's. You wouldn't want to have two vaginas? No. No. Would they have their periods? Would your ears have their periods? That is so disgusting. That's a lot of periods. <laughs> That's two periods? Could you imagine? Would they be in sync? I don't know. There's too many questions. I'm just. I'm just. Penis. Penis is for fingers. Done. Too many. Too many things to think about. Would you have to buy tampons and pads for your ears? Shwan. <laughs> Earplugs. <laughs> Could you get pregnant through your ears? Remember when they said ear sex? Now you can actually have. Shut up. <laughs> Moving on. These last three are. Um, yeah. <laughs> would you no? Would you rather have sex with Donald Trump? Uh, uh or lick a hobo's foot. Lick a hobo's foot, thank you. I am not touching that. <laughs> Do you remember that 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 sculpture that that artist made? I I forget her name. I believe it was a she. I believe yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> It'd be. But you would rather lick a hobo's foot? Yeah, most certainly. Get it over with. Quick. He's, he's just been outside walking all day. Ain't got no shoes. Hey, you didn't tell me what kind of hobo. You didn't. I know some very clean hobos. <laughs> <laughs> do I get to pick the hobo? No. You you asked, so no. I do. <laughs> Done. What would you? <laughs> I, I just ain't asked. The no. What would you rather do? <laughs> What would you rather do? I, I had to answer number one. I just asked the question. Shaquan! I'd rather lick a hobo's foot, but I would do it with my um, lick a cat tongue. What? The lick a cat tongue. What the hell is that? Would you rather continue with your life or restart it? Oh, that is a good one. Like, it, so is it the same life? Or is it like a completely different one where you could get like a worse life or a better life like right off the bat? I'm sorry. Would you rather continue your life the way it is or restart your life? I don't know if it's the same life. It literally says, would you rather continue with your life or restart it? Period. Continue. You just want to continue your life? Mm -hmm. I'd rather restart it. Why? Because I, because there's no other information given, am able to restart it and it be the way I want it to be. But also, I would also rather continue it because I've learned so much and done so much and I now know where I'm going. So I think I would rather continue it. The logical thinker needs to weigh out both options and then come to the actual conclusion of the one that he would rather choose. Whatever. Emotional thinkers go off their emotions, which has now got you to continue your life, knowing that you could have this whole brand new life in front of you. Mm. I'm good. It's all right. Puberty sucked in the first place. Who said you had to go through puberty? I could come back as a cat. That's like I, there, that there's like no there, there that that question if is so broad. You like to do <laughs> no. That question is so broad that it could just include anything. I, you, you could come back as a homeless uh -uh. foot. That is the devil. <laughs> Last but certainly not least, would you rather have sex romantically or try some new kinky ideas? Romance. I mean, it doesn't say how many times. I'm just saying one, like, it, that to me sounds like one time, so romance, I'm good with it. I know that it'll be good like that. 
I'd rather try some new kinky ideas. Of course. You so we've got work to do. So <laughs> wait, what kind of work? <laughs> Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe what, this video, and share with all your friends, darling. Give me bottom jaw. And make sure you Hi. tell us, answer all of the would you rather's with your opinion, and come up with some more in the comment section. We'll be answering them all. My life, my love. Superwoman. Oh. That is a wrap. And zoop. This ain't a superwoman video. Bye, guys. Oh, baby, I'm yours. Oh.